Is it going? Hi. Hello. So today we're just going to do a little garden tour. Show you what I'm going to do, what I have planned. So these, these are my yard long pole beans. See how long they are? I'm getting ready to pull them. The flowers, you can just see because it's early morning. But then it's going to go all the way up here. And I get to have them hang down. These beans will be amazing when they start hanging down. Then, I have to watch where you're walking. <laughs> We're going to go that way. I'll get my peppers. I got lots of peppers. This is my first zucchini. See him in here? Isn't he cute? And he's super cute. Okay, shut up. All right, it's still going. So, this, I have a volunteer. <laughs> you need to touch it. <laughs> volunteer artichoke plant out front that I'm going to put here. And then. Volunteer tomato plants out front. So I'm gonna put one here and one at the end down there. But those, there's my cilantro. Looks like something is eating it. Something's eating my cilantro. Hmm. And I just put these in last week. And they're doing good, except for something eating them besides me. Huh. I don't know. Could be anything. <laughs> hmm. Alright, what else do we want to look at? I have my tomatoes. I took a bunch of them off so they're not so tall. And this is a sucker. And so I'm going to let the suckers go and see if I get tomatoes off of those. So this one I left up there because it's still got a tomato and blooms up there. I'm gonna have the two tomatoes down here. This one I took all the way down. I'm walking through spider webs. <laughs> Aren't you glad I'm walking through them before you? I'm gonna take all these off because with all this growth, there's not one tomato. So these are all gonna come down and I'm gonna put beans here. It's getting later in the season. Beans will do good here. So hot that we had to film first thing in the morning. This will be one of my other tomato plants. I pulled out one and I'm going to put another one in there. Um, I need to take down all this. This is the, the lemon squash. And they, they're, they pretty much run their course. They've gone all the way up and come all the way back. There's the end of it. So I'm thinking that they might be done. This is just a tomato plant. And again, no tomatoes. I'm thinking that see how the blossoms are already dying. I might have blossom end rot because they're just already falling off. So those are going to come out because why am I growing toma giant tomato plants that don't have any tomatoes? And look at my bag over there. I did three more bags out front. Should we look at the progress of those? Sure. Okay, let's walk out front. Super excited about them. Why this is out here. Huh. That was our water gun fight. We had a water gun fight. I bet everybody's jealous of our water gun fight because it was fun. Huh? Yes. Those are radishes. This one, you gotta see one right here, but there's um there's only the one right now and that's spinach. And then there's a couple little ones here and that's lettuce. 
And this is my hodgepodge. I still don't know what this giant plant is right here. It started out with the leaves being purple, but they're not purple anymore. So this is one of the tomato plants, plants that I'm gonna pull out and put in the backyard. Oh gosh, I have so many. And then I'm gonna pull one of these ones out and put it in the backyard. So I don't know what this is. This is potatoes growing again. It's crazy, right? And that's stinging nettle. And that's lettuce. And these are all little volunteers in this plant. Planter. Those are my... Those are... Beets. <laughs> but they're not doing so hot. I pulled some out that were big, but these are just little baby ones. Little tiny baby beets. They're so not ready. Little beets. And my celery is dying back, except for the new celery that I put in here. And the strawberries are doing great. They really love this planter. The planter like this out back, I'm going to put onions in. I'm going to try onions in it. So there's a strawberry. And that's it. That's the artichoke I'm going to do too. See how long it gets? Maybe that's my problem with the beets is the root is so long that it's not doing so well in the shallow pot. It's like a tap root. It's long. That's it. That's the garden. Thank you. Thank you. Be earthy.